Hey Spooky Cuties, welcome back to another unboxing video. You guessed it, it's the Simply Stylish Gothic Stationery Company unboxing. Now this is May's and hopefully this isn't too late because I've been a bit bad, I know that. If you want to see what's in May's box, then keep on watching. This month's box is the first box that they've done collaborating with another artist in its entirety as I understand and this is a box by Print Is Dead and they are a Nottingham based artist. They work mainly in digital but also in pen and ink and they create beautiful art for darker souls. I'm all about that so let's get into this box shall we? Now this box is thinner than the last couple I've got, which doesn't mean it's not absolutely packed because as we know stationery is flat. So let's see what we've got, shall we? Ta da! <laughs> oh, I've knocked Oogie over. We have our thank you note, as always. Do we have a what's in your box note? Because we didn't have one in April, so let's have a look, shall we? Ooh. Oh my God, I can already see this is stunning. So this is a little notelet. Oh yeah, what's in your box on the other side? We've got a little notelet about print is dead. Um, as I said before, Nottingham based artist. Um, so I will pop their details in the description below. Um, so unlike other subscription boxes who beat other companies down on prices to boost their own profit, we pay companies, we work with their wholesale price, a price they're happy to charge and we're happy to pay. Artists cannot pay rent with exposure and we will never add customers for free or discounted items. And that is why I love this company, they're eco, they're ethical, it's it's great, like it's just so cool. So if you read that and you paused, you're cheating. Let's find out what's in this box, shall we? So oh I don't know what to go for first. There's so many cute things. Let's do this one. Oh, oh. so this is a gorgeous card. The detailing on this is stunning. I'm never giving this to anybody as a birthday card. This is getting framed. This is amazing. Oh, when they said that they create art for darker souls, this is what they were on about. This is absolutely stunning. And on the back is, I'm assuming, their sort of like little note card about their brand. Oh, I love this. I love this. Okay. Next, let's go in for the little pin badge. This looks to be a little wooden pin badge. Oh, it says it's a wooden pin badge. Come on, Vanessa, use your eyes. And this is a gorgeous um, death moth in a skull with some greenery or purpley around it. That is stunning. And oh, a card. Oh, this is this is divine. Next we have a beautiful bookmark with a skull holding um, some flowers and a gorgeous black tassel. I do normally open these so let's get these open. Ooh, very shiny. This is lovely. I've just smudged my fingerprints all over that. Gorgeous little black tassel. That is wonderful. take out the notepad. So we have a gorgeous little purple and blue star bordered notepad with the stars are sort of running through the line work if you can see that. This gorgeous little black cat and a scully on it. Wow 
once again it is a really nice thick little notepad absolutely beautiful let's open our one and only stripy package this time and you'll know I'm a sucker for these little stripy bags don't ask me why I just love them In the little stripy bag, ooh, we have a little vinyl sticker which says Belladonna oh, with a little skull holding it with some little dried flowers, I'm assuming, and a gorgeous little print, um, sort of postcard size. This is a gorgeous uh, sort of mid torso skull with flowers running through it. They are beautiful, I love those. This is definitely getting put up somewhere. We have this very weighty, oh, that's snuck out of his packaging. Um, I thought this was gonna be a really gorgeous sized pin badge, um, but it's a mirror I just saw here. It's a gorgeous, now I'm not gonna show you my setup too quickly. Um, but it is a gorgeous little hand mirror. Now, I have a little hand mirror like this that I've had since I was a wee teenager that my auntie bought me, which is um, pink and it's got um, a very Avenged Sevenfold skull with, the, with wings coming out of it. Um, so I love that I've got a more sort of older, up-to-date, or more mature, I guess, up-to-date version. That is so stunning. And then last but not least, oh, this is very weighty. We have a gorgeous little print, which is these little flowers with little skulls on the inside. Oh, oh. Ah, yes, it's a gorgeous little print just supported by a nice thick piece of card. And uh, the print is dead. Um, calling card, I guess got their details down here and their website I mean honestly I would I would frame this bit too <laughs> this is stunning so let's get this out of the way and let's find out what was in our box now as always if you got the midi box this is what you got if you got the maxi box you got all of these things and if you got the monster box you got everything now i get the monster box um oh and i might be in with a chance of winning this time because hopefully i get this edited and up today maybe or at least up before the 10th of june so let's find out what we got in our box in our midi box we got a postcard and a vinyl sticker we sure did We got a bookmark, we absolutely did. And a greetings card, we sure did. This is absolutely stunning. I wonder if they have a bigger print of this because this is gorgeous. In the maxi box, you would have gotten the pocket mirror and a wooden pin. And then in the monster box, which is what I have, you have the ooh, A5 notepad, sure do, and the A5 print. Now this apparently is an exclusive design for this box only. This is stunning. I absolutely love this box. So I will pop um, this artist's information as well as the Gothic Stationery's information down below. Um, let me know what your favourite bit was. I am obsessed with this print. I absolutely love this and I really love this one as well. So I think these are my favourite things this month. Um, but I mean, I have to say this is really stunning and really weighty, sort of really well made. Um, yeah, I really enjoy that. Let me know if you have the Gothic Stationery's subscription box or if you bought anything from them. 
and let me know what your favourite bit was. Um, you, you all know what I'm obsessed over this month. Let me know if you also subscribe to any gothic subscription boxes and I will see you on the next one. Bye!